Okay guys, so today I'm going to be showing you how to create a pixelated photo in PicMonkey.com, which is a free photo editor. So first I'm going to start by just going to PicMonkey.com and it's a, it's a really handy dandy free photo editor. So you're going to come up here and say click to open now I'm going to go to my um, my desktop and actually it's in my um, advanced art posterized photos right here. Make sure you know where your photo is before you open it. Okay, so there's me. I'm going to start by cropping it. So it should be under basic edits. Click crop. And what you want to do is go here where it says no fixed proportions. You want to change that and say square. Now I want more of my face than that, so I'm going to make this as big as I can width-wise and sort of center it on your face. You want it to be square. Hit apply. So now I have a square photo. I'm going to come over here to this magic wand. Click that. Depending on how fast your internet is, it might take a little while. I'm going to scroll down here on the left, and you're going to find Focal Pixelate. Okay, it's got sort of graffiti on it. Click that. Now, what I'm going to do is turn my focal size way down because I want pixels everywhere. And then depending on how high quality your photo is, you may want to have as big a pixels as you can if you have a really high quality photo, or you may want slightly smaller uh, pixels here. So people who have made it so far um, have about 17 blocks, so let me just count 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17. Um, I would recommend having 17. It seems to be a good number of pixels. So I'm going to have it at 17 blocks. You can just literally count it. I'm going to hit apply. And then I'm going to share it. Okay, so just click it. And then it should show up right here. You can enter a description if you want. You're going to say share it by email. You can share it by Facebook and stuff if you want to later, but share it by email first. Type your name in. Type your email address in. And you want to send it to me. So hcone at asb.ac.th. Look how it turned. Out. Okay, and then say do it. Then it's going to create it and it will email it to me. Now you can also click on this link and see how your how your picture turned out. Okay, any questions send me an email. All right, have fun. Oh, one last thing. You should try to find a photo that has a nice balance of light and dark, and you may want to find something that has interesting colors in the background. Don't do this in black and white. It's a color mixing exercise. So have fun.